Now come to the next series. So 0, 1, 2, 5, 12, 29 and 70. This series is basically known as PEL series. Okay. So in this uh, PEL series, the th uh, third term or the next term actually generated by adding the first value with the multiplied 2 by 2 by with the second value. It means this 2 is generated by adding the first previous value of uh, first value 0 plus and multiplied by the second value by 2 so into 2 so 0 plus 1 into 2 it becomes 2 now what is how the 5 is generated the previous two value is uh, 1 and 2 so first value is going to participate into the addition and the second value is going to multiply it by 2. So 2 into 2 it becomes 4 plus 1 it is 5. Now 12. How 12 is generated? The previous two terms is 2 and 5. So 2 the first value is uh, going to add uh, normally and the second uh, value is going to multiply it by 2. So 5 into 2 10 plus 2 12. So this series is generated by in this technique. Now I am going to write, uh, write the program. So uh, before starting the loop, I am declaring here another two variable and initialize by uh, 0 with the first value and b with the second value. Okay. And declaring another variable suppose c. And before starting the loop, uh, I am just uh, write the or sorry, I am just uh, going to print the value of a and b before starting the loop okay so in this portion i am just print the value of a and b so this two term is already printed okay this two term already printed or you can also uh, use the com uh, complex if statement within this uh, loop uh, if else if uh, else statement and uh, in this uh, in this way you can also print the 0 and 1 within this loop uh, without writing the value of a and b before the starting the loop okay so uh, if the if i'm uh, if i'm just uh, print the value of a and b before starting the loop then loop will start from the one and uh, as the two value is already printed so i uh, is uh, run up to n minus two terms so n minus two and value is increased by i plus plus and in this case also the uh, lcb or loop control variable that is i is not related with this series okay the this value is related with this uh, variable a b and c now within this loop i am going to uh, doing the operation as per the uh, mention here so a into sorry a plus b into 2 okay now after writing this i am going to print the c and then after i am writing a equals to b and b equals to c uh, value will generate how uh, let's see so c a and b is printed suppose here so 0 and 1 already printed so c equals to 0 plus b into 2 it means 1 into 2 so uh, sir, uh, print the 2 so 2 is printed here and then after a equals to b it means value of a becomes b the value of b is 1 so a becomes 1 and b equals to c and value of c is 2 now I again run the program 1 plus 2 into 2 it means 4 plus 1 that is 5 so 5 is printed here okay so in this way this pair series can, is uh, solved now come to the next series uh, the uh, series 10 and it is going to print the pair series okay pair series means sum of the previous two terms but first term and with the twice of the second term right so let's see I am just initializing, uh, sorry, declare and initialize the two values with the uh, variable uh, a equals to 0 and b equals to 1. It means the first two terms and then after I am taking the input in uh, the number of terms from the user and, uh, and then after I am uh, just print here the first two terms a and b in this portion. Okay, you can see I am just print here a and b in this portion. Okay. So the first two term is printed just before starting the loop and uh, a and b and for this reason the final value of the loop is n minus 2 as it is two terms the first two terms is already printed before starting up the loop and then after just uh, doing this operation c equals to the first term a plus 
twice of the second term that is b into 2 okay and then i'm just print the value o c and then a equals to b and b equals to c now i'm going to run the program so let's see the program asking me to enter the term so suppose 10 terms so 0 1 2 5 12 29 70 like this so suppose 12 so 12 is the sum of the 2 and 5 so 2 plus 5 into 2 that is 10 plus 2 that is 12 okay so pl series is generated now if i wish to uh, print the a and b within the loop but not before starting the loop how it actually it is work so i'm just removing this line from here okay and as the uh, as i just uh, wish to print the two initial uh, sorry two first terms within the by, uh, loop or using the loop so the loop will execute up to n terms okay not n minus 2 before because uh, no uh, value actually of the series is not printed before starting the loop that's why uh, the final value of the loop will be up to n terms so you can see uh, the I'm just using the complex if statement within the loop and if the value of i equals to 1 then print the first term and if the value of i equals to 2 it means the position is 2 then I'm going to print the second uh, uh, number of uh, that is b and rest of the other position value uh, it is going to execute the else statement okay now let's see what's happened yeah, the desired output is generated or not uh, enter the number of terms suppose 10 terms okay the output is generated as just same as previous okay so you can see the pl series is generated here and by using this technique or by the previous technique you can solve or you can generate the pl series right